The existence of some coastline communities are threatened. The latest coming from Bras local government area, Bielsa State. A state governor on his visit to the affected sites, however, appealed for help from the federal government and other interventionist agencies to save coastal communities from being submerged by the Atlantic Ocean. Joseph Kunde has details. An age-long problem that has constantly plagued coastal communities in Bayelsa State has prompted the boat trip by Governor Dovye Diri to the Udioma community in the Braz local government area. The governor is led to have a first-hand assessment of the devastation caused by the ocean surge on the community with the loss of another building destroyed by the ocean encroachment. The state government is set to embark on a 1.5 km shore protection project to check the ocean surge that has submerged about 250 buildings in the last decade. I believe that coming to see things for myself, having a first-hand knowledge about what is going on here, we'll start to do something as usual. The way we have approached the Nembe Brass Road, we have started something and uh, we call on all of our development partners the federal government in particular, and the oil companies to join the Bielsa state government to keep Odioma safe. Not only Odioma, we have same instances in Kuluama, we have same instances in Sangana, and so we have so much to do which is beyond the scope of the Bielsa state government. With over 130 meters of land and buildings lost to the ocean, some of the victims and community leaders lament the situation. What we have lost so far from 215 is about 130 meters has gone to the sea. The current is increasing every season. I've lost about 6 billion before this one. So about 70 and the cemetery and some other valuable in this end, and the farmlands too. So it's very devastating. We have oil wells here, and we have other bigger projects that is coming. I think the government, the federal government should do something because we are oil producing community, oil producing kingdom, and we need changes. While the state government has promised to begin work on shoreline protection, more collaboration is needed in many other communities affected by coastal erosion in the Niger Delta region. Joseph Kunde, TVC News, Udioma.